Hi guys, it's Jay from J and D's Retirement Journey. Just wanted to say thanks for watching and please hit that subscribe button and that like button. Thanks so much. Hey guys, today we're going to do a quick stock analysis of ConAgra Brands Incorporated, CAG. ConAgra Brands is a food manufacturer, CPG company located in Chicago, Illinois. They have approximately 50 locations, 18,000 employees, and the revenue approximately $11.5 billion. And they have a ton of brands that everyone is familiar with. Some of the brands are Slim Jim, Duncan Hines, Healthy Choice, Ready Whip, Pam, Oval Red and Backers, Vlasic Pickles, Bird Eye, Boom Chicka Pop, basically Popcorn, Dukes. You guys take a look at the list. Uh, it has a ton of brands. All this information is right off the ConAgra website. Do your research and talk with a financial advisor before you make any investment decisions. I'm not a financial advisor. What's right for me and my wife may not be right for you guys. As of the close on 1-6-2023, ConAgra Brands had a price of forty ninety six, a 52-week range of $30 to $41. Let's take a quick look to see what the stock has done over the last five years. Uh, it's up uh, $11.58, $4.25. Over the last three years, it's up $9.00 and almost 29% over the last one year. It's up $6.79, almost 20%. And year to date, it is up a little bit over $2, uh, 5.5%. The financial results right off the ConAgra website, second quarter net sales increased by 8%. Operating margin increased by 320 basis points in the quarter to 16.6. Adjusted operating margin increased 237 basis points to 17. Uh, the earnings per share increased almost 39%. They came in 15 cents above the estimates. So the stock has been going up the last few days. The company recently raised its uh, financial outlook for 2023. They expect growth of 7 to 8% compared to fiscal 2022 and expect earnings to land somewhere between 260 and 270, which represents 10 to 14% growth compared to 2022, which is great. The historical earnings for the last four quarters uh they beat, they beat all four quarters. Take a quick look. This information is right off the Charles Schwab website. Let's take a quick look at peers and ratios comparisons right into the overview. The uh, market cap looks like it's about 20 billion. P is around 29. The annual dividend yield, which I love, is 3.22. The earnings three to five year forecast is 8.3% and the net margin is 4%. ConAgra's valuation, the price to earnings, it's uh, 28.94. Price to sales, 1.63. The annual dividend is 3.22 and the five year projected growth is 3.49. The fundamentals, net profit margin, 4.05, return on equity, 7.86, sales per share, 2501, long-term debt to equity, 93.26, and the three to five year EPS growth forecast, 8.3%. My favorite subject, my dividends. Uh, they just gave out a dividend of 33 cents. The next dividend goes X, uh, January 27th, 2023. And it's a pay date of March 2nd. So you guys have time to uh, jump in and grab the next dividend if you're interested in this investment. 
their uh, annual yield is 3.22 and the annual dividend is $1.32. The last six years of dividend history, it's gone from 20 cents to 33 cents. That is huge for all our dividend investors out there, including myself. The dividend payout ratio, 90.42. Dividend coverage ratio, 110. Total dividends paid 129, which went up to 132 for this year so far. Five year dividend per share average 95 cents. Five year dividend yield average 2.77. Profitability the gross profit margin 25.43. Net profit margin 4. Cash flow from margin almost 11. Cash flow per share 177 and the cash per share MRQ 8 cents. Let's see what the analysts think about this company. Reuters has a hold on it, a sell of uh, zero, underperform two, hold nine, outperform six, and one buy. SP Global just uh, updated. The target price seven dollars. They upped it seven bucks to forty four. They have a, f a four star buy rating on the stock. The market cap. It's a mid sized company. Nineteen point five two billion shares outstanding. Four hundred and seventy six million shares held by institutions. About eighty two percent, which is great. Whenever I share uh, such a high number, the big guys are in it. Mutual fund EFTs, which is good. Uh, the shares shorted from the previous month went up hope you found this information useful and again before making any type of investment decision talk with your financial planner do your research and good luck guys